Welcome back to our channel guys. What's going on everybody? If you are new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and join the family. So I obviously didn't wake up in someone's house today and get to steal a gift to put it underneath our Christmas tree because we had to make time for someone else. And that someone else is a young girl named Angie. Okay, so now let me give you guys a little backstory on why we are filming today's video. So for those who don't know, my dad runs a camp for kids with sicknesses and disabilities. So basically this camp is located out here in Los Angeles and kids from all over the world get to fly in and spend some time there and meet other kids that also have like the same sicknesses and disabilities as them. So it's a really fun place to go. So Angie happened to be a kid who was a part of this camp. And this is how my dad introduced her story to us. So the other day we were running some errands with his dad and we were talking about like a whole bunch of random stuff and he was like so there's this girl that I know of that is a big ace family member and he told us a little story hello sorry what I'm already getting teary-eyed why I don't know You're thinking about it? I don't like stuff like this okay so Austin and I always hear stories we always hear you know like this person's a fan this person's done this this person and like we never really have like a deep connection with it like we're always super excited to hear things and like we get so happy and it's always nice to hear nice things about us and what we do but this specific story really like got our attention yeah, and it's so hard for Catherine and I to take action because there's so many situations um, and it's not always like easy to do certain things yeah. and so this specific story is interesting because he actually knows about them. So to make the long story short from what my dad told us because we haven't met her just yet Angie has cancer not sure what type of cancer she has But she was in the hospital recently and it got really bad to where she had her leg amputated And um, um And so <laughs> And so basically what he was saying is she it's really rough for something to happen like that to anyone and I can't even imagine what she's going through but Alan his dad told us that she has been having a really rough time obviously and she says that she watches the Ace family and the Ace family no you don't start crying so just let me let me get some get some hair okay so while she was going through this tough situation um, and after she had her leg amputated, she was pretty much saying that she didn't want to be here any longer. And she said that the only way she could push through life was from watching our videos. And she said that the Ace family gives her a sense of hope. Yeah, when his dad said that to us, like, I automatically in my mind was thinking, this is one of the major reasons why we do what we do. Like, there's so many stories, there's so many people in this world that have their own unique stories. And every single one of them that watch us, watch us for the same reason, which is crazy because it's like so many millions and millions of people all around the world going through different things. Like you could be on your phone right now watching us in a bathroom stall. You could be on your phone watching us right now in the hospital bed. You could be, you know, in your room cooped up by yourself or you could be with a whole bunch of friends and family members around you. Like there's literally so many types of people in this world watching our videos. And like for us to hear that specific story and the fact that it was able to get to us from right. his dad was like, oh my God, like we have to do something about this. We have to meet her. Like even if it's just like a phone call or a FaceTime or like anything. And just the fact that she's here in LA, we're like, and it's Christmas time, it's the holidays. Yeah. We were thinking like, we have to go meet her. And we, we just found her. out about the story like a week ago. And for yeah. us, once we heard it, we were like, yo, what can we do? in such a short period of time, especially that, you know, Christmas is in, you know, yeah. two days from yeah. now. How can we do something for her to hopefully, you know, make 
her smile. So as you guys know, we're filming Vlogmas. We're filming every single day, so we're super busy, as you guys know that. Um, but since it is the holidays, we do want to go see her. And what better way to go see her with all of you guys as well? She has no idea, guys. She has no, she has idea. no idea. My dad set the whole thing up. Only her mom knows. She lives, I want to say, less than an hour away. And... She has no idea what to expect. And the good thing is she is no longer at the hospital at the moment. She's at her home. So we will be going to her home. So before we go, we just want to say that we just went to go look for a gift for her. And to be honest, we were like thinking about it. We we're like, we don't really know her. So we don't really know what she likes. Right. We don't know what like. But it's always sizes. hard. We don't it's know always hard to get anybody Christmas Anyone gifts. Anyone a gift. So what we were thinking is that we are going to be giving her a card with money everyone likes money because money can get you what right. you want you're able to get exactly what you want something that we couldn't have thought of yes. so we're just gonna do that i think that's you can't better. go wrong with money you can't go wrong, can't with, go that. wrong with money to be honest we just didn't know what to get her and we weren't gonna go empty-handed so so yeah that's a gift <laughs> money it is oh we do have to give her some ace family merch but we are out of stock right now so yes. so she'll get the new collection when it comes out yeah Next Angie, one. <laughs> stay tuned for the new collection. You'll be the first to get it. Oh, and we are going to be restocking. So for everyone asking, we are restocking very soon. Uh, we just sold out of everything super, super fast, which is a blessing. But then again, we were like, ugh, because not all of our AIDS family members were able to get everything. Yeah. Stay so tuned. stay tuned for that. Stay tuned for that. Obviously, you guys know the link. ShopAceFamily.com. Link is always in the description. So I think it's time. Ace family, wish us luck. Keep Angie in your prayers. God, please don't allow me to cry. I don't want to cry when I'm there. Hold it together, Austin. I, I get, get so emotional. I get really emotional when it comes to stuff like this. I do not like hearing anything like this. But when we do hear stuff like this and we're able to do something about it, it's like the best feeling in the world to us and that's why we do what we do. I just want one smile, Angie. If you can just smile once for me, we've done the job. All right, Ace family, so we're pulling. Oh my God, is that them? Oh, oh no, is it them? I think oh, it is them. Please don't, don't, don't look that way, don't look that way. All right, Ace family, so. We we're currently trying to find the house. I'm gonna call my dad so we can call her mom to let her know that we are pulling up and to come outside and to keep it a surprise. And so we can um surprise her. Yo, so I think we just pulled up, but we're not sure if we're at the right house. Can you call the mom and um see if she could come outside without telling Angie? Yeah, I'll do that. Um, it's a surprise, right? Angie doesn't know. No, she doesn't know. Okay, perfect. Yeah, call her mom and let her know that yeah, we're... If you're, if, you're in front of that, if you're in front of a house, you don't see it because you got to walk around the back and there's another house in the back. Okay, um, I just saw the address and it matched, so I'm not sure. So her so mom can just, just come outside. Yeah, see just... if her mom can come outside and she'll see. Okay. Let, let her know that we're in a, um, the red Range Rover. Okay, I'll call right back. All right, thanks. Bye. There she is, there she is. I see her, I see her. Alright, you're gonna hold the camera right? I'm actually nervous. I'm super nervous, Jesus. Hey, family, Ryan's with us today to be the cameraman. Thank you so much, Ryan. Of course. Thank you, okay, Ryan. So How do you say park in Spanish? Parquear. Parquear? Si, si. Mama, please tell me you didn't tell Angie. We want this to be a surprise. super surprise. Well, you never know. Alright. I feel like... Alright, 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 alright. Right. Okay. Ready to get up? Alright, Ryan, take it over. Bye. Oh, High five. High five. Whoa, that was a good one. I want one too. No, 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 Ask her if she told Angie. Le diste? No, no. Ella no sabe que estamos aquí, no? Where, where is she right now? Pero no sabe para nada, no? No, no, no. I don't know what they're saying, but I think we're, we're good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so proud of you. His dad told us your story. We were um, and I just feel like he was meant to tell us this so we can be a person because I don't know, I just feel like it was just meant to be. Oh yeah, my physical therapist. I would talk with the, about you guys every single day. And it's like, I feel like I annoy him with like, his family this, his family that. 
And he mentioned, oh, my last thing, I was like, oh, you don't even know the Ace family? I was like, you want to tell me this when I'm leaving? <laughs> oh my god. So you had no idea? So you have no idea? <laughs> I had no idea. My aunt came and she was like, get ready, we're going out somewhere. And then she took a nap right now. And that's why I got ready. Uh -huh. And I was like, where, 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 when, when are we going somewhere? When are we going? They were all getting excited. I'm like, why are you guys getting excited? Are we leaving now? And then she comes, she's like, oh, the Packers won. And I thought, oh, that's why we were excited. <laughs> and then you guys walk in, I'm like, <laughs> what? <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> How are you? You good? Yeah. Yeah. I'm good. <laughs> you look good. Oh, thank you. You look really good. How is everything? How is how you feeling? I'm actually being a lot better. Yeah. At first, I was still dealing with like the side effects, uh -huh. but my body's getting so what, stronger. What kind of cancer did you have? Osteosarcoma. Oh. It was a cancer in the bone. So you don't have it anymore. I don't have it no more. Thank God. Yeah. Like my whole life, I I I'm gonna end up presenting my first hospital I went to because they said um the chemo wasn't working and they decided to continue using it even though they knew it wasn't working and so my parents they got upset because they're like if it's not working we gotta find another solution because right. two weeks into chemo and they're like oh we gotta amputate all the way up here and so we decided to look for another yes. hospital and that's where we found children and. We were transferring, but they kept holding back the documents, so they wouldn't take us until they faxed it, and they were purposely holding them back. So I went, what? yeah, I went a whole month and a half what? without crazy. chemo, and then it was spread from here all the way to here. You know, Christmas is around the corner, right? And we're gonna be honest, we didn't know what to get you. This is hard trying to get gifts with someone that you don't really know. So you obviously are going to get the new Ace Family merch that comes out soon. Yes! Okay. Oh my god! You're going to get a new collection, okay. okay? So we'll make sure to hook you up with our team. So as soon as it comes out, you'll be the first to get it, okay? Okay. And then we also want to give so, you something. Um, so, so that's for you. That's a lot of money. <laughs> that would have been good with 20. No, 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 no. No, no. get whatever you want. Get whatever you want, that's for you. Oh, yes. Whatever you want to do with it. Whatever. <laughs> And then we also we also want to hang out with you like another yeah. time like whenever we can yeah. do something off camera off you know us hanging out you can come over for dinner. I want to hug too. Can I get a, can we get a hug in here? Come on, baby. Let's get a good hug in here. Yay. Well, Merry Christmas. Yeah. You know how busy we are these yeah. days, right? It's crazy. We wake up, film, edit every day. Me and her, so we always wait till seven, and the second seven hits, the, we get the notification. We're like, all right, let's go, and we all get together. We watch it on your phone. Yeah, <laughs> just me, her, and my, my little sister. Yeah. Every day. It's so awesome. Would you have ever guessed like? No. 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 At all. At most, I thought we'd probably like go eat at my favorite restaurant, but that's just, like the most I'd expect as a surprise. What's your favorite restaurant? Express. What? Express, that's your favorite. <laughs> oh yeah, we gotta introduce you some Well, Ace Family, it's time for us to say goodbye. Thank you so much again for having us over. And your family, thank you guys. Appreciate it. But before we go, is there anything that you would like to say to the Ace Family? Yeah, um, hi Ace Family. Just know that if you guys are going through a hard time, no matter what it might be, um, nothing is gonna stop you from going forward in life so you just gotta push through it and work harder mm. i love that ace yeah. family you heard it <laughs> straight from angie herself so much Aww. So, <laughs> the most humbling experience ever seriously i'm so speechless because it's like you hit it right on the head right and you said that how does god know who to help right and like the thing is too it's like as like we're driving around like I'm seeing all these houses, all these neighborhoods, right? And it's like, there were that one neighborhood, that one house that had us walk into today. You know what I mean? What are the chances of that? And I'm not sure if you guys noticed this, but she was very positive for everything oh, that she's yes. been through. Oh yes. For someone to be that positive. Extreme even positive. like being held back, she goes, well, at least like it's easier for me now. Yes. You know what I mean? So she's like, being held back a year in school, which is really messed up. And I don't know why the system did that, but yeah, anyways, she, um, yeah, because she missed out. 
And she was even positive about that. I was like, was I'd like, be well, so at least, mad. At least testing's gonna be easier for me this time. Yeah. But like she said, when you're positive and you just keep fighting and you have faith, anything is possible. You can get through anything. Yeah. Exactly. And yeah, on our way here, I was just texting my mom and I was like, we're meant to help people. Like, this is what we're meant to do. This is part of our destiny. And it's like the best you know? feeling in the world. It's the best feeling in the world. But I always knew, like, in my heart, like, when I was growing up, when I was little, Ryan, wouldn't, wouldn't you say? Like, yeah. I was You're always, always, meant, always meant to help people. Yeah. And I, mean, I just want to keep doing it. You helped me wipe my butt till I was, like, 15. No, so. literally. I used to wipe his butt <laughs> till he was 15. A natural helper. Like, this is part of what we were meant to do. We, we were meant to meet for a reason. We were meant to make people laugh, entertain people. So Angie, the entire Ace family is very proud of you for everything that you've been through. Yes. And the fact that you are still so positive and have a smile on your face and keep fighting. You want strong girl. Yes, you are one strong lady. All right, Ace family, we have made it back to the house. Today couldn't have gone any better. Shout out to my pops for putting this whole thing together. Being able to meet some of our Ace family members and knowing about their lives and their stories and being able to help in any way possible is literally the best feeling in the world. So hopefully Angie's story touched some of you guys. We know that some of you are going through all types of different situations. Mm -hmm. All and types of situations, like everyone's story is different. Right, and whatever you're going through, just know that we are with you and just to keep fighting, keep pushing, keep being positive. And everyone has a story, it doesn't matter who you are. We have a story, the person next to you has a story, you have a story, everyone's different and we're all in this earth together. So thank you all for tuning in as always. But before we close out today's video, we do have to give our post notification shout out slash thousand dollar winner to. Okay, so. His name is Anthony. Oh. Okay, so today's post vacation shout out goes to Sophia Butler. Hey, shout out to you, girl. Thank you so much for being part of the Ace family. Sophia. You have just won a thousand dollars. Let's go ahead and send you that thousand dollars, Sophia. Even though you know you got two more days to buy Christmas gifts, but still use this. Okay. okay. So whoever else like a post notification shout out or have a chance to win $1,000, all you gotta do is subscribe to the Ace Family, hit that subscribe button, turn on our post notifications, hit that bell button, download Cash App and comment below your cash tag username. And obviously if you like today's video, you gotta give it a thumbs up. Give it a thumbs up for Angie and how strong that girl is. And make sure to comment below something nice and positive about Angie. So like, comment, share, and subscribe. And like me and my beautiful queen always say, we'll be, we'll be back, back tomorrow. tomorrow. Peace.